hello hello everyone welcome to informatica customer support videos in this video we will be covering how to collect the pm stacks on the core files agenda of this video will be why uh, there is a need to collect the pm stacks so uh, whenever you have a mapping failure uh, sometimes informatica customer supports ask you to create uh, generate the pm stacks on the core files so uh, that is because uh, your mapping would have been run into the crash scenario and hence it has by default generated your linux server has by default generated a core file uh, and you uh, will be asked to uh, collect the pm stacks on top of that core files so these are the error messages you could uh, you can see in your logs to understand if it is a crash situation uh, dtm un uh, unchecked exception transport error origin so these are the similar or look alike messages you will be see you should be in a position to see in your logs to understand if it is a mapping crash or scenario mapping crash scenario so uh, in order to have the core files generated there are few prerequisites so in uh, informatica server must have the core file size parameter set as unlimited and you can see the value of uh, being set for this parameter by running the command u limit minus a as you can see in the screenshot um, core file size the first parameter is set as unlimited so once this is unlimited this uh, you will see the core files being generated in infra home tomcat bin path so what is the pm stacks uh, basically so the core files which uh, are generated in the, in the crash scenarios are not in the readable format and in order to analyze it we need to collect the pm stacks on it so in, pm stack is basically a utility which is available at the informatica server uh, path infra home tools debug tools infra dump so once you trigger this it will generate a trace file that you can share with the gcs for troubleshooting the issue that what has caused this mapping to be uh, fall under the crash scenario so let's have a, a quick demo of how we can collect it and uh, what are the ways to uh, collect these pm stacks so as of now I, you can see uh, that uh, at the server path infra home tomcat bin i have a core file uh, which got generated due to a mapping crash and uh, i can see in this path which is infra home tools debug tools infra dump there is a pm stack utility so i will be uh, generating the trace file on pm stacks uh, trace file on top of this core file so uh, the command will be like pm stack hyphen c the name of the uh, core file now this core file is available at some uh, path as info home tomcat bin so we have to provide that path so that uh, it will be able to find that file info home tomcat bin core once i am uh, uh, executing this command you can see it has uh, started collecting the trace and it has created this uh, uh, trace file now let's see how it looks like so it, it will be look like core uh, dot uh, the pid of that uh, file followed by the uh, uh, timestamp now you this core file this is how it looks like so this is a, a readable format file and hence it will be uh, this will give you an idea of why on what thread and what uh, uh, block it has been it, it has been crashed on so you can share this file with the customer support and they can help you to analyze the reason for this uh, mapping failure for this crash we will love uh, so these are the uh, links kb links that you can use to get the additional details on this uh, utility we love to hear from you please uh, reach out to support videos at informatica.com and you can share your feedback on the twitter handle as well uh, thank you uh, for watching this video